Oh, look at him maybe shake hands to start this match. Good sportsmanship here. Yeah, I like to see this. Or, or oh no, I don't like oh, seeing that. Sportsmanship. This is what I like to see. Let him fight. Well, that's gonna fire him up for sure. But guys, you know they should have known better than to take the bait. Yeah, it's clear there's a total lack of respect between these two. There's the bell into this highly anticipated match. So anticipated, these combatants couldn't even wait for the bell. But should we really be going through with this match after what happened before the bell? Well, if you want to go stand in the way of these superstars, go for it. Before I'm sitting, it doesn't look like there's any stopping them. slam! Uh-oh. Dropping the elbow right on the knee. Oh, yikes! A stomp to the guts! You can see the dismay on the face of The Miz. Yeah, the Ozilla is proving hard to keep up with. Tossing their opponent like they're nothing. And The Miz might want to look for some of his shortcut tactics after falling to that attack. He planned for this and could still rally. Miz counters with an attack. To the belly. Ooh, what a nasty kick. Just disrespectful. And I don't think there was anything necessary about that. Oh, and then the chest as well. Miz is a great tactician, and I'm sure he already has a game plan. But I wouldn't mind seeing him being a bit more aggressive tonight. Remind people exactly why he's so awesome. Might be a good move, Corey. We've seen that mean streak on occasion, and it usually serves them as well. Heads outside, but this one has to end in the ring. Fires back with a crucial elbow. Great job refocusing to reverse that. Try to break Reed down with that maneuver. And Reed moves out of the way. Bam! Lands a kick to the gut. Good defense. There's no denying Miz brought his A game with an attack like that. Boom, right across the small of the back. The Miz now in complete control. And that's the mean streak of the Miz coming out. He's tapping into that aggression we all know he has deep inside here. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. Jumping neck breaker. Ouch. He's got him by the leg. Oh, that hurt. And he gets delivered back into the ring. Miz way up high. From the top. Open ended here. Kicks out. Really had less than a second to stay alive. And now Reed is being measured. Just got clobbered. Unexpected result there. Thunderous power slam. Hoisted high up across the shoulders into a sit-out axe driver. Oh, look out, man. shoulder up before three amazing throwing everything in the kitchen sink in there but to no avail and an elbow drop for added measure elbow drop picking up speed off the rope hip drop to the gut the Miz at the complete mercy of his opponent. Miz needs to rely on his resourcefulness. Oh, stop to the tummy. Tummy? This is it. 
with the win. Here is your winner, Bronson Reed! Some could say this loss really added insult to injury. It was enough to be disrespected earlier on, but the loss definitely didn't help matters. I think a true congratulations is in order. Sure, they were disrespectful earlier, but that clearly didn't hurt their game. In fact, if anything, it might have given them more of that competitive edge. Honestly, you might have a point there, Corey. They clearly wanted it more here. A new day, the power of positivity has taken over my hips, my heart, and my entire soul. Come on, guys, clap with me. Sit new down, Saxton. Day I will not stop, Corey. Day rocks. The following contest is a tag match set for one fall. On the way to the ring, at a combined weight of 417 pounds, Xavier You know, the only thing worse than this pancake and unicorn parade is that I know for a fact these guys are going to launch their clothes at me. <laughs> Don't be a negative Nancy, Corey. That's just part of the fun. It's not fun. And they need to fire whoever's doing their laundry. Oh, look out, Corey. Look out. <laughs> The best in the world. forget the night of Punk's historic return. But now, Punk must prove himself. Says he's now home, but many competitors have said this is no longer his home. Punk has never been more focused. He's now down to business, and he wants to rewrite his legacy and write a whole new chapter in the WWE. Punk's return was an amazing moment, but now he must capitalize. Yeah, easier said than done because the competition is now at an all-time high. Is being the best in the world still good enough? <laughs> Here we go. 
The Fashion Files are on Raw. And from seasonal residences, weighing in at 212 pounds, Tyler Breeze! As the song goes, Tyler Breeze is part man, but all model. Yeah, if style points existed in matches, Tyler would always receive the most. And it's time to show once again, he's more than just a beautiful face. Maybe he could give you some fashion tips, Byron. Byron, you're an uggo. <laughs> whoa, whoa, that's not cool. Why would you say something like that? Because it's true. I have sources. You have lies. Byron, I know you have a feeling in you. A feeling of power, perhaps? Uh, yeah, Michael. The power of positivity is in full effect courtesy of the New Day. You know, nothing keeps these guys down. It's probably their best attribute as competitors. Very true. New Day does love to roll with the punches. They'll have a lot to roll with tonight. This could be a night of tag team action at its finest. Yeah, you can't ask for a much better matchup than the one in front of us, gentlemen. We know that taking out the legs is one of the most effective strategies in any match. And the corner he goes, a perfectly placed target. Puck wasting no motion on the counter. Makes him pay with a counter. First row, And that's the tag to Kofi Kingston. Got the tag, got the tag. Tag is, good. tag is made. What's gonna happen here? Boom, off the boot. For the record, Saxton, you and I would never have that kind of chemistry. Oh, that'd be a great teammate. I've seen you trip over your own left foot. No thank you. Uh, tag made. Oh, right to the gut. Man, oh man. Putting up a united front as this match continues. Suplex. <laughs> Tossed into the corner. And he saw Kofi coming. Working the midsection there. He's in off the tag. Oh, right to the throat. Great move. Woods is feeling it, and he doesn't care. Who knows? Trump kick with precision. display of strength with the suplex. Wood's solo talents couldn't do much to help him against that attack. Yeah, Tyler looked confident. Quickly, the cover. And there's the kick out. A truly impressive kick out this late. Oh, look at this. Float over neck breaker. Picture perfect. Vicious right forearm. And 
the knee. He's struggling a bit here. This is when you have to take advantage of tag team rules and get yourself some breathing room. No good reason to stay in this right now. A handle applied. Up and... Oh, wow! Face first! Round and round into the... Satellite DDT. Vicious knee. Can he score the pin? And he powers out. Just barely, but it counts. Oh, oh, out of nowhere! Just gets the shoulder up. And frustration might be starting to set in. Hand and elbow. Boom! There's a tag. Got him set up in the corner of the ring. Unprettier. What's Kofi going to do? Beautiful monkey flip. Follows up with a crossbody to follow. These men have shown no indication of staying down. Their guts, their fire won't allow them to give up. Tag is made, and he's coming in hot. Bang! Springboard roundhouse. Good night. Now he's been put on the defensive. The power of positivity paying dividends for the New Day. Emphasis. Tag made. Oh, I think something bad is about to happen to their opponent. Woods might have this wrapped up. Cover! And they're still in this. Punch! Face first. Well set up on a Koji. How's he gonna get out of this predicament? Elbows his way out. He foiled that attempt. the corner now. Uh-oh. Turning the tables there. Using the elbow to escape the attack. Cuts off their offense with a swift elbow to the gut. Quick exchange, reversing the reversal. Suplex attempt. Able to go behind, though. From behind, chop block. What are we going to see here? Quick screw neck breaker. He may be in a bad way here. These two teams have gone to war, Cole. Of course, they're going to wind up with a few battle scars. Beautiful athleticism. DDT. Attacking the arm. Great way to break down your opponent. And he sends him into the corner. Tyler Breeze gets tagged in. Tag is, good. Tag is made. What's going to happen here? Yeah. Oh, the boot. oh, counters right into the bread basket. Woods with his opponent. Wheel barrel face buster. Cover. And he makes the save for his team. Ah, oh, jumping knee strike. Lights out. One, two, three. The crowd is fully behind Xavier Woods right now. This is when Woods becomes dangerous, when he can feed off this arena's positivity. And Woods saw it coming. Bulldog! Planning on what to do next. A lot 
Watch this, fellas. Driven into the barricade, spine first. Dropping the leg. Big risk here. He may be counted out. He might be oblivious to the count, guys. Vicious right forearm. Breeze is feeding off the WWE Universe. Able to get there in time. Textbook jumping clothesline. Oof. Good golly, Miss Molly. This place has come unglued. Rightfully so. Effective arm drag. Set up in the corner of the ring. In full control here. Face first in the turnbuckle. What's Kofi going to do? Beautiful monkey flip. Follows up with a crossbody. Kofi's on fire. Tyler Breeze with a serious reason for concern. He can really stand to get back as good as he's getting right about now. Yeah, Breeze isn't looking too gorgeous at the moment. Tyler Breeze apparently needs some space. Yeah, get out of my air. Kick right to the back of the leg. Oh, and the reversal by Tyler Breeze. Hooked up. DDT. Here he comes off the tag. Tag made. Oh, I think something bad is about to happen to their opponent. Down they go. Will Xavier put it away here? Makes the cover. He makes the save for his team. Punch connects. Close line to the back of the neck. Ooh. Hooked up. Look out. Followed by an overhead kick. He's running on empty right now. Not what you want to see by any means. Tagged in.
terrific drop kick. A deafening cheer from the WWE Universe is reverberating around us. Absolutely unreal. Springboard and misses on the springboard. Knee strike connects. And that's the tag to Kofi Kingston. Some serious damage and Kingston being brutalized again. Time to see how much CM Punk has left in him. Oh my god, what an elbow! Engineering right on the mark. Dodges. Something bad is about to happen to their opponent. Down they go. Kofi was perfectly on target. Pin. Hey, wait, 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 wait. How can that be fair? Come on, ref. Keep these guys in check. Up. And look who's here. Ah, oh, some taunting going on. Future matchup, perhaps? I'd say that's a highly likely possibility. She is ready to get in the competition's face. Mi Chin is as Mi Chin does. Never afraid to do something crazy. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring, representing the OC from Fontana, California, Mi Chin! You know, guys, what I like about Mi Chin is that she isn't afraid to stand up against injustice here in WWE. Or you can call it standing up. I call it sticking her nose in other people's business where it doesn't belong. 
Well, we know she just loves getting in people's faces, and maybe, just maybe, she'll get in your face, Corey. Coming talent in the women's division. If you ask Indy Hartwell herself, Cole, she's not up and coming. Indy believes she is already main event worthy. And from Melbourne, Australia, Indy Hartwell. Pretty cool fact here. Indy began her in-ring career at just 19 years old. Or how about this, Michael? Indy Hartwell made her NXT and main roster debuts by the age of just 23. I had my first match at 16. Where are my flowers? Why does no one talk about me? You guys are biased. Meechin loves to fight, and she can come at you from any direction. She can get down and dirty on the mat, brawl if she has to, or even take to the skies. Meechin's as versatile as she is dangerous, and she's as dangerous as the day is long, especially when she's focused. And she looks especially focused here tonight. And indie wrestling is more than ready to throw down, ready to have some respect put on her name, ready to push her own limits, and ready to go. That move had the amount of force akin to a natural disaster. Oh, that'll send a shock down your spine. Uh-oh. And a suplex. Going way up high. Flying. Whoa! Diving corkscrew moonsault? And I think we just saw a good answer to Hartwell's killer instinct right there. The competitor in Mi Chin coming through here. Heads out of the ring, but needs to be mindful of the referee's count here. DDT spiked. Mi Chin is looking unstoppable now. Indy needs to be resourceful in this situation. Corey, we know what Indy Hartwell is capable of. Is that going to be too much for her opponent to handle here tonight? Well, by all means, Hartwell's a powerhouse, but she's not the most experienced competitor on the roster. A smart opponent will exploit that. Ooh, what a headbutt. Meechin heads up high. Look out! High impact missile drop kick. Steer clear of that. Hit the ropes. Brutal knee to the side of the face. Both arms trapped, looking for something big here. Tearing down the leg now. Right to the leg. Crushing the hamstring. Whoa. Hamstring crushing knee strikes. Repeated strikes. Consecutive attacks keeping Meechin off her game. Indy has her opponent. Couple of clotheslines. Place kick right in the face. She returns the favor there. Meechin is going to look to press on the advantage. Prime opportunity now for Meechin to get some separation and gather herself. Hammerlock DDT. Is it enough? The cover. There's two. <laughs> oh my gosh. Can you believe it? She pulled off the victory. She shocked not only her opponent, but the entire WWE Universe. But you can't strike a referee. She's going to be heavily fined for that.
Johnny Gargano, Tommaso Ciampa. This is DIY. The following contest is scheduled for one fall on the way to the ring at a combined weight of 400 pounds. Tommaso Ciampa and Johnny Gargano. DIY. I've been fortunate enough to call many of the wars these two men have fought side by side and against each other. They are a fun team to watch. Two men who have been the heart and soul of NXT. They brought that same passion to the main roster and have quickly become a top team in the WWE. And we're about to see that passion on display. Here come two superstars made of pure athleticism. The Street Profits are more dangerous now than ever before. Yeah, they may still party, but it's all business first. And their opponents at a combined weight of 492 pounds. Raise your cups for the Street Profits. We only have bottled water, you idiot. Well, look at me. I've got a cup. Check it out. What is in that cup? It stinks. It's homemade kombucha, Corey. Hey, you want some? No. Your loss. Ford and Dawkins are still great athletes with tons of personality, but now they've made hurting people their business. And quite frankly, Byron, it's a necessary evolution for Dawkins and Ford. These two are ready to make the jump to the all-time greats of the tag division. Johnny Gargano and Tommaso Ciampa, collectively known as DIY, ready for action. That acronym is what fuels Ciampa and Gargano. They were never expected to even make it to WWE, but they have become an all-time great team because of DIY, or do-it-yourself. It's brought Gargano and Ciampa very far. Let's see if it leads them to victory tonight, too. And let's not underestimate the intensity of the Street Profits. They may like to have fun, but sometimes fun for them translates into bringing the heat. Well, that heat must explain the smoke they're always after. Getting him into the corner. Uh-oh. Face full of turnbuckle. Boom! Right the button. Ooh! -ho -ho. Drives a foot into the stomach. Ah, oh, flipping the script on him there. Oh, good God, reverse Hurricane Rana. All their weight landing straight on the cranium. What a game changer. There's the takedown. Angelo Dawkins with a well-timed shot. What's coming next? A back suplex. Gargano showing his alertness there. Kick out in 
one. He's nowhere near ready to stop fighting yet. Left by the turnbuckles. Whipped across the ring into the turnbuckle. Followed up in your face. Meet Canvas. Oh, target in the arm. This has got to hurt. Trying to take away that grip, that range of motion on that end. Oh, and that startles Johnny. And there's a neck breaker. Tag is good. There's the tag. These two are redefining teamwork. Gut buster. Oh, my. And the knee strike. Those two are... And he goes for the pin. He gets the shoulder up at two. He thought he had it. Big punch finds its mark. Both wrists captured. And man, knee strike. Nasty stop to finish it off. Getting carried around, bad spot to be in. Well placed elbow, looking to escape. Oh, that didn't look good for Dawkins at all. And now blood starting to trail down his face. Counters, this could be an opportunity. He went right into that turnbuckle. He's returning fire. An answer for every move attempted. Oh, what a splash. It's like an SUV falling on you. Vicious right forearm. Oof. That... Uh oh, forearm gonna cut off the wing. He... The guillotine locked in. This is all. That was an incredible counter. to the face. Rocket launcher. They finish each other's sentences. They finish each other's moves. That's tag team excellence right there, gentlemen. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Ouch. That's one way to get your opponent out of the corner. He's got to be agonizing for the arm. He's feeling the effects of that last hit. might not have a pleasant ending. Oh, man, right to the esophagus. Dawkins with a spear. For the win. Two. Fights out at two. And you got to think, he's just one final blow away from not kicking out next time. All the way over. What are they doing here? Right on the arm. This could be big, going up high. We're going to finish it off. Swan time bomb! Dawkins showcasing his strength. Absolutely. Dawkins is breaking his adversary down. Placed in the corner. Gargano snap it over. Followed by the... That should do it right there! And a kick out at only one. It's hard to believe, but it looks like he still has some gas left in the tank. Famous, sir. Solely focused on... Ooh. Caught by the back of the elbow. What a shot. Devastating kick. He may get the three count right here. I think so. And there's the save. Ooh. 
and Gargano with ring awareness. Back suplex, no! Driven down. And the cover! Yeah, no, he doesn't get the three. That is just pure instinct at this point. He got whipped into that corner. That holds back Ford's attack. Oh, the DDT! Oh my gosh, what impact! He's tagging out. Taking a moment to get pumped off of this crowd's incredible energy. Ooh. The unrelenting offense from these superstars, the will to keep going, that's what this is all about. The clubbing forearm. Vicious right forearm. Big blow could be felt throughout the arena. Oh, saw it coming. Boom! Improving a bit slippery for the man. with that sharp elbow. Montez Ford sending a clear message. And the kibosh being put on Montez Ford there. Yeah, they stuck it out through this match, but it wouldn't hurt to go for the tag soon here. Uh-oh. He's turning the tables. Look at this heel hook. This is how you punish your opponent, and he's enjoyed every minute of it. Stretching and tearing at all the ligaments in the leg. Oh, continuing to punish them. Looking wobbly in the corner. Return fire for Montez Ford. Coming with a clothesline. Tag is made. Some showboating from Johnny Gargano here. He's taking a moment to feel the crowd, but he better focus on the opposition. Yes, tag. Connecting with a sharp elbow. Locate something. Running Hurricane Rana. Fantastic. A tag made. Here comes the double team. What do they have planned here? Oh, a revelation. That could ground Gargano for good. He stops the count for his partner. He's been placed in the corner now. And he saw that coming from Montez. Oh, what a counter. And the energy in here is raising the hairs on the back of my neck. Oh, I love this one. Slice bread. Clean tag for his partner. And tag. He's in now. Finally. Uh-oh. Flapjack. Way up there. Kick to the abdomen. Compromised position here. Uh-oh. He's got him scouted. Nasty knee. He's going for the pin. This could... Be it. Forces the shoulder up after.
Factor 2. What? What? Oh, what do you say? That This is amazing. What a match. Oh, point of the elbow finds the mark. Johnny Gargano calling on the WWE Universe to fuel him. Tag made. Tag made. Uh-oh. He's able to fend off the attack. Cut off with a kick to the gut. Sent out of the corner. Keep your eyes on Montez Ford. Rolling Thunder Frog Splash. This could be it. Cover for the win. Oh, I thought it was over, but again. Can we please get some control? them to get even better.
The LWO is here, representing the culture, representing a legacy. That's what they're all about. The following contest is scheduled for one fall on the way to the ring at a combined weight of 365 pounds. Joaquin Wilde and Cruz Del Toro, the LWO! Let's go! The LWO is out here to have some fun and show just what they can do between those ropes. Never underestimate the LWO because they are a talented force to be reckoned with. most beautiful import sent to us in a pair. Yes, boy! And their opponents at a combined weight of 357 pounds, the NXT UK Tag Team Champions Elton Prince and Kit Wilson Pretty Deadly! Kit Wilson, Elton Prince, two exceptional in-ring talents with exceptionally inflated egos. Jealousy is not a good color on you, Saxton. Despite their outfits and antics, this is a highly competent and accomplished tag team. Hopefully they can focus on their in-ring work here tonight. They've shown their focus every single match, Saxton. Pretty deadly are everything their name says they are and more. The two goofs in the super crop tops are Kit Wilson and Elton Prince, collectively known as Pretty Deadly. Goofs? Cole? These two men are as professional as they come. They come into work every week to take care of business. It's not a crime to look good doing it. In fact, I think the only crime around here is one of fashion, and I'm looking in your direction when I say that, and the Saxons too. Well, I would love to see some of that professionalism in this match then. That would be pretty deadly. If you ask me. Repping the LWO on the other side of the ring, these guys are already in the zone. Ready to show up, to show out. Ready to show what they're all about. Got him set up in the corner of the ring. Oh, a gut buster. Comes in off the tag. Nice clothesline. Shoulders down. This could be it. And the referee stops the count before two. Fighting hard to stay in this match. Measured knee drop. And that will bring... Wait, 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 wait! Gets his shoulder up before the two count. He's far... Oh, strong impact! And just raking it. We'll be looking at things here with the Cobra Clutch. Fading quickly. He is determined not to lose this match right now. 
Ah, takedown. And now punches right. Vicious, aggressive attacks. Just going all out with every blow. Ah, oh, the physicality on display there. Unbelievable. Reaches his partner for the tag. Placing them into the corner. Wrist lock, and they'll turn it into a... Just punched him right in the mouth. What a relentless break in the face. My God. That's how you wear down your opponent. Crank in the head. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. Ooh, forearm connects. Oof, nails the midsection. Into a powerbomb. Del Toro has become relentless. There's incredible impact with every maneuver Cruz delivers. Oh, and an uppercut. I lost the tooth. him some time. Delta. Uh oh. Oh, red right in there. Here's the snapmare. Followed by the knee drop. And a fracture in orbital. He's in a little bit of trouble now. Yeah, this is exactly why constant, frequent tags are so important in a match like this to keep fresh. Del Toro trying to get under his opponent's skin. Scoop slam. count in the nick of time. Oh! With authority! There he goes, right into the corner. Uh-oh. Face first in the turnbuckle. Oh, and he answers back on Cruz. Oh, over and over, knees in the corner. That's relentless. That'll turn your lights out. His shoulders are down. And that'll do it. It's finally over with the win. Here are your winners, Elton Prince and Kit Wilson. Pretty deadly. This pairing pain, strong dividends with an impressive tag team win. You can't keep the LWO down for long, though. This loss is only going to make them come back that much stronger.
Here comes trouble. The Judgment Day has arrived. One of the most dominant groups in WWE. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring, representing the Judgment Day from Adelaide, Australia. The NXT UK Women's Champion and the WWE Women's World Champion, Rhea Ripley! A unified front of highly decorated, highly skilled, highly dangerous competitors. When united, they are truly lethal. May they consider themselves inevitable, as if nobody can stop them. Well, nobody has so far. The Judgment Day, almost creative in their physicality. They take pleasure in it, Michael. I hope medical is standing by for this one. Well, the Judgment Day quite simply will do anything to win. Well, there's competition, Corey, and then there's what Judgment Day is willing to resort to. Here comes the number one gal from the Alpha Academy. A model student in more ways than one. And representing the Alpha Academy from Phoenix, Arizona, Maxine Dupree. Gorgeous looks, improving by leaps and bounds every match. Maxine has all the good Dupree genes. Hey, question, uh, whatever happened to Maxine's brother? I heard he just disappeared into the night. Every week, Ripley just gets more ruthless. How do you prepare for that? You have to be mentally prepared as well as physically for a master class in brutality. Maxine Dupree may seem bubbly and even vapid at times, but she's a smart competitor with a ton of energy. Not taking her seriously in the ring might be the worst mistake you could make. Dupree has shown us that she's dedicated to improving her skill set and becoming a bigger threat in the... Wait a minute, setting in. Devastating submission coming. Abdominal stretch. Fighting out of That's it. That's one way to get out of it. Down in the basement with a drop kick. Uh-oh, this isn't going to be pretty. Nice suplex. That was a massive suplex. There's core strength, and then there's what we just saw. Oh, and an elbow. Dupree showing no fear, no intimidation. She steers clear of that one. Reversal. Can they go on the attack? Oh, look at that scope slam. That is attacking with malicious intent. Oh, man, that's like death by a thousand cuts. Delivering nasty stomps. And a slap for the exclamation point. Practically never-ending blows coming at full force here. Oh, my God. As of late, we've seen Rhea Ripley head down a sinister path. It has to be quite challenging going into a match with someone as menacing as Ripley. Ripley's the... And will this be it? One, two, no shoulders up at two. You have to think this match is starting to take its toll. The 
Does the official not see him removing the turnbuckle pad? Keep your voice down. She's taking things to ringside. Taking it outside the ring now. She might be in some trouble now. And as this fight goes on, Rhea's reaching new levels of brutality. Oh, straight forearm. Boom, nice. As impressive as that was, it has to take something out of a smaller competitor. Boom! Dupree with some agility. And now she delivers her back into the ring. Big boot to the gut and a clubbing forearm. Up and down, what a slam. There's Maxine with a counter. Uh, she's trying, trying to create space. Evades their offense. counter producing a trampling and Rhea with reason to question her confidence after that attack yeah and that can be a building block for Maxine to build upon <laughs> and she's stunned in the corner Going up to the second rope. Ooh. Oh, look at this hanging arm bar. Great way to break your opponent's arm. Stops Ripley's attack. She can end it here. Kick out at one. She's still got a lot of stamina left. Got their opponent set up. Drop kick to the back. She heads out of the ring. Interesting strategy. And now thrown back into the ring. Getting set up for something in the corner. She's in serious pain. I don't think she even knows where she is at this point. Stumps. No respect being shown whatsoever with those stomps. He is looking to do some serious harm. Now a series of vicious stomps in the turnbuckle. Just a barrage of stomps. Tails it out of the ring. Nothing wrong there, just dictating the pace. Ripley uncorking a clothesline. And another Whoa. ripcord position. Ripcord drop kick. And she slides her back to the mat. She saw it coming. Unbelievable display of will in the late stages of this matchup. Boom, right across the small of the back. They are fading off the WWE fans, now pinning the arm down and... Ah, goodness gracious. And now she's climbing to the top turnbuckle. From way up, block the effort and cut them off with a shot to the gut. Check your face after that one. Well, the ref doesn't even 
and see the cover. Valuable seconds passing as they're distracted. That's gotta be it. Two count. Rhea Ripley did it. What a huge win. Here is your winner, Rhea Ripley. Rhea Ripley earning a big win here. Maxine Dupree really gave her all. But her all wasn't good enough. Hopefully, she'll use this as a learning moment. Rollins has arrived. The outfits, the outrageousness. There's nobody like Seth freaking Rollins. The following contest is scheduled for one thumb. Making his way to the ring from Davenport, Iowa. Weighing in at 217 pounds. The NXT A storied career, Rollins has held every singles and tag team title of note in WWE. The first ever NXT champion. The first man to hold the newly minted World Heavyweight Championship. Rollins is one of the most complete competitors this industry has ever seen and is a cornerstone in WWE. You want to prove yourself? Test the visionary. Yes, Byron Big E's on Raw. And yes, Michael, I feel it. It's the power of positivity. And his opponent, representing the New Day from Tampa, Florida. It's all about the movement of smiles and positivity. One of the most powerful men on the WWE roster. Got a little extra pep in his step here tonight. Big E's ready for battle. We'll start things off with Seth. Let me take this, Cole. He is a visionary. He is a revolutionary. He is Seth freaking Rollins. A man of many names, but they all mean the same thing. Winner. Rollins can't be held down, and he will always adapt and rise above. Sure, what he said. And staring him down is Big E. A man who I've said has all the tools a superstar needs to be at the top of WWE. Big E just needs to keep his focus on being an aggressor, being brutal, being the powerhouse that he truly is. I don't completely disagree with you, Corey. Big E should try to assert dominance tonight, but if he wants to get those hips moving and bust a move too, I wouldn't object. Oh, that hurt. Rollins with the wrist trap. Oh, there it is. Ripcord 
left knee. Is it enough? Only a one count before the kick out. He is certainly sending a message, getting his shoulder up before two. Oh. knee right to the face. Oh, man. Oh, torturous knee. Taking off from the ropes. Piggy on the wrong end of things there. That type of physicality, earning Rollins. He wait, 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 wait. Early kick out, referee right on top of the action. This isn't even close to over. Oh, maybe time to start burning it down. Rollins is starting to roll. Lands an elbow. Going up top. Oh, look out. Five star frog splash. Just as Rollins envisioned it, everything's going according to him. And that'll about do it, folks. Here is your winner, Seth Freaking Rollins! Big E leaves here tonight in defeat. Well, maybe Big E needs to put more focus on his opponents than on goofing around in the future. Behold the intimidating sight of Gunther. The ring general is ready to come out here and do what he does best inside the ring. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring, representing Imperium from Vienna, Austria, weighing in at 297 pounds, the WWE Without question, Gunther has made an immediate impact since his arrival. A truly dominant specimen. And a specimen who is as ready as ever to chop clean through the competition. Hey, he puts others to the test, and they often come up short. He moves with such a purpose, absolutely no wasted energy. Well, that's because Gunther is saving himself completely for the battle ahead. Yeah, but he does manage to make his entrance as intimidating as possible. Uh, here's an extremely impressive young high flyer. And his opponent from Dayton, Ohio, weighing in at 183 pounds, Wes Lee. He was known as a tag team competitor before joining WWE, even won the Dusty Classic and NXT Tag Team Championships early in his WWE career. But now has grown as a singles competitor too, winning the NXT North American Championship even. Somebody call air traffic control because Wesley is about to take flight. Prepare to see an air on the display like none other. We're underway, and the ring general's in peak form for this one. Every move Gunther makes has malice behind it. This man wants to punish people. Oh, it's going down. Few competitors are as comfortable 
almost happy in hostile environments as Gunther is. The ring general rises to another level of warfare as the battle rages on and is focused on one thing, domination. Wesley standing across from him, and it's hard not to root for this kid. He's really found himself as a single star. Came the WWE as part of a unit, forced to go out on his own and put his foot on the gas. He's become a superstar that WWE Universe can be proud of. He does whatever it takes to succeed, and the results are speaking for themselves. With Gunther's militant stature and no-nonsense ring style, how could anyone usurp the ring general court? Where the high oh, misses the mark. Oh, and he's able to counter. From the outside, look out. Whoa! We've seen how he could pin his opponent right here. And he breaks the count quickly. Just kicking out at one takes a lot in a match like this. Four to that attack with a European uppercut. Look at this heel hook. This is how you punish your opponent, and he's enjoying every minute of it. And set right into the corner and finds a counter. Look at this. Oh, from the rope. The WWE Universe is pouring more fuel on his fire right now. Gunther catches him by surprise. Whatever's playing here can't be good. What now? What now? He's getting a little battered now. That shows you the ring general's genius in action. Whip back into the ring. Uh-oh. And Wes's counter. Take down. Looking for the cross face. It's cinched in. Looking to free the arm and does just that. Vicious combination of strikes. Looks like he's got 11 arms and feet. So much damage inflicted. Oh, God. Knee meets face. He went right into that. Not to the back of the neck. Sends their opponent to the middle of the ring. Handstand into a Pele kick. That's it. Gunther is out. Try to end it. No, stops the count at two. I didn't think we'd see a kick out there. Just breaking down the opponent. Gunther looking a bit rough for wear after that. This is where endurance becomes so important in the late stages of the match. Just punched him right in the mouth. Relentless. Enough already. And oh, fiery Larian. Oh, right to the throat. Great move. To the corner. This can't be good. He reverses it. Ah, oh, targeting the arm. This has got to hurt. Solely focused on punishing the leg. Hooked up. Driven down. He's stalking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Incoming. What a splash. That's the astonishingly crushing offense we've come to expect from Gunther. And that's a big win right there. And I'm going to check on uh, his opponent. Oh, hold up, hold up. The, this superstar. No, oh, come on, this is uncalled for. Now, what does this prove?
The long boats have landed. The Vikings are here. The following contest is a triple threat tag team match. On the way to the ring, at a combined weight of 552 pounds, the NXT Tag Team Champions, Ivar and Eric, the Viking Raiders. Hard to stop this in terms of spectacle. An effective intimidation tactic. Vikings were smart warriors. They're waging a mental war. Well, it's working, because I'm pretty scared. And nobody's surprised at that. The tension building for this match is so thick you can cut it with a knife. A lot of drama involved with this one. Gallus is here, and they are ready for a fight. And at a combined weight of 486 pounds, Mark Coffey and Joe Coffey Gallus! The recklessly dangerous team of Gallus looking focused tonight. There's no telling what sort of damage they'll deal out in this match. Gentlemen, I have a four-word prediction for tonight. Gallus boys on top. Tornado tag with multiple teams facing off. Things are going to get frantic fast. Whatever team comes out of this with their hand raised is going to make a strong case for being the best in WWE. Just like that, Sonya evades. You can see that each strike drained their opponent's energy. Take this match as long and as far as he needs to. 
Oh, a right hand for good measure. And he cuts bait, slipping out of the ring. Shut up, Saxton. This is just a small regrouping. Ooh, headbutt from the rear. Great strength being shown here. Just how desperate do you have to be? side area and as we can see tensions really running high now oh uh, yeah we should probably clear the way guys and Sanga's competition got the best of him there and Ivar with a wherewithal to counter oh he retaliates oh great rearranging our ringside furniture here clearing the announce desk what a mess toss back into the ring and he saw that coming from Eric. Boom! A forearm smack! Put in a position now. Oh, not a power bomb off to the apron! Fishing for something beneath the ring. He's looking to unload on his opponent with that kendo stick. He was elusive there. And there is no other term for that than just cheap, a cheap shot. No doubt 
battle like this one unfold. Here he goes for the win. Oh, and he breaks up the pin. Big forearm. Short punch. And that was a successful bit of offense with that maneuver. Chance to best move on here. A mess slam with some attitude. Chuck that ball. And now gets tossed into the ring. Ooh, a direct headshot. Just sickening. Right in the head. Yo, Kofi, get ready. Sock is in deep peril here. Far into the match, and Eric isn't letting up. And you have to imagine Mark can't tough things out much longer. big-time victory for this tag team here tonight. Absolutely. That's the kind of win that can catapult you to bigger and better things.